and Grim with those big clubbing fists and those fists are made of bone just remember that again with a uh, Grim with a roll up here a counter Samus' shoulders are down for the two count near full <laughs> uh, excuse him. Excuse him what? Take over you. Well Grim is looking focused here, man. Oh, chop lock. Right to the leg. Grim going down low. He's already been down low a couple of times. Here's another Reaper sleeper, as he calls it. The second one of this match. Was he looking for a submission victory or something? Again clubbing down on Samus. Well, he probably won some kind of satisfying win here to send a message to the person that's currently at ringside now, which is Peach, of all people. Would you have seen that? I would. I definitely didn't see that one coming. I don't think any of us saw it coming. Peach is unleashed, shall we say. But why does she want Grim out? I'm still puzzled. This is still still a big mystery to me. Why, why does Peach, of all people, want Grim taken out? Well, Samus, if he hopefully delivers the finish, if she hopefully develops the, the uh, wait a minute, capture suplex, or the bounty plex, as Samus calls it. Trying to look for the victory there, and as you said, Eggman, or we're going to say, yeah, if Samus wins this one, then she's going to be picking up a hell of a lot of cash, because you know Peach is just crawling in it. She's rolling in it, swimming in it, and wait a minute, boy, that, uh, uh Grim going for the that reverse jumping tombstone but Peach he was conveniently positioned for her to just to climb on the apron and uh, disrupt that move another chop lock to the leg and exchanging uh, eyeballs again with uh, with uh, Peach telling her to come into the ring and I'll, uh, I'll take you out as well violent violent not dates I'm gonna keep that focused in my mind yeah you do that and Samus with a really hard punch here knocking Grim down and it, the elbow dropped right in the gut and uh, this impresses Peach apparently man that was a very modest clip she's absolute royalty you know oh wait a minute here's the capture suplex Grim is hooked up his shoulders are down on the canvas and only gets a near fall out of that one Samus could have been picking up a lot of moolah there. A lot of fabulous moolah. Yes. Shut up. <laughs> what? what? I like talking about money. Oh! And Grim likes to kicking uh, females in the face. Oh man! He just sandwiched Samus under the canvas and wait a minute, Peach is out cold. Well, she's history from one kick. No wonder she wants someone else to take out Grim. There's the reverse jumping tombstone. One, two, and three. And Grim has made a big impact here at No Mercy. And has brung all that he could bring. And then some. He just kicked Peach right in the face. He's not looking too healthy now. Peach has been taken out. Well, that proves she can't defend herself. She took one baseball slide in the face. And she's out of it. She'll be having an asthma attack in a minute. Get her to a hospital fair, Samus. Well, she's not going to be very happy with Samus. We'll have to see what develops from this on Smashdown. But Grim with a nice, clean victory here. I'm impressed. He's going to get what's coming to him, though. He's going to get what's coming to him if I know that princess, which I don't, which I do know. Cool, she's a feisty one. Okay, shut up, Mr. Horny. I like her outfit. That was from the Mario Strikers, wasn't it? Okay, shut up, gamer. Stop telling me to shut up. Anyway, the Hardcore Championship is up for grabs next. What is going to happen between these two as they prepare to destroy themselves? And of course this will be the return, the miraculous return of the hardcore champion who's been out of action for a little time, not thanks to an injury but thanks to Cyrus can he shut him up tonight and retain that hardcore title and of course Wario is stepping into his own kind of match which is a hardcore match, every 
which every hardcore title match should be contested in. I think I got that right. <laughs> But here comes the number one contender, and what a number one contender he is, and a former number one contender as well, because he was one of the one of the number one contenders at Summer Strike in that fatal four-way match for the Hardcore Top Championship, and we haven't seen Wario since then. But uh, ever since he got drafted over the SmashDown, he's been the very absent champion. And Nightmare is going to make sure he continues to be the absent champion because uh, he wants to destroy Wario here. That's all Nightmare wants to do to his opponents. And that's wipe him off the face of the earth. And like a, this has been a one-sided affair. But here he comes. That familiar music strikes. And there he is. And there is the Hardcore Champion, returning from a very long suspension to say the least, but he comes here tonight to fight, as always, in what Wario likes best, and that's in a Hardcore match, and that's why he's a champ. And you were talking about Peach's fireworks and Pyro, what about Wario's, that's got a custom bomb. <laughs> well, Wario's got the money, because he steals it. That hardcore title racks in the cash as well. Remember all these championships, and not just for show, that are for show that you're the man, you're the top thing at that, at that stage in your career, and you get all the dosh when you're a champion. And that's what Nightmare wants. He wants to step out of the shadows and into the spotlight and become recognized here in the SF. He's had a very dominant run, it's about time he got a decent championship match. Of course, Nightmare has been on the road uh, for the uh, Money in the Bank, where you get that elusive title shot to cash in whenever you want, but currently being held by Knuckles over on Raw. And Wario returns here with a bit of impact, look at the strength! Oh man! And now, and then Nightmare turned his pursuit to Wario for the Hardcore title. Ended up in a fatal four-way at Summer Strike. Oh man, that's gonna hurt. Ended up in a fatal four-way Hardcore match for the Hardcore title at Summer Strike. That was last year, of course. Of course. Now you're, you're the one acting dumb. So who was acting dumb in the first place? You? The uh, silence. Thank you. Continue calling the match. Wario, oh man, he shots right in the face. But uh, Nightmare was awfully impressive at Summer Strike. Oh man. And uh, and he got uh, several near falls in that match. But the uh, the match ended in a timeout. It ran out of time. And Wario walked out and retained the hardcore title. That's why Cyrus, I don't think, believes that Wario, one of the strengths as Nightmare, lifts up Wario all the way on the outside of the ring there. Yeah, my freaking nose. <laughs> Wario coming back in. Oh no, wait a minute. Got a big shot there from that belt that uh, Nightmare had in his possession. Now Wario's in the corner there. And wait a minute. Oh man. And that's an, an another low blow by Wario. Man, he just likes picking on every body part you own. That couldn't be further from the truth. And again, targeting that head, drilling that ring bell in the face. Every weapon is legal. This is a hardcore match for the hardcore title, of course. Falls count anywhere, no disqualifications or count outs. The first person out of these two to get a pinfall or submission will be walking out here as the hardcore champion. And we've got a nice long time limit as well to settle this on. So Wario doesn't have the luck of the time anymore. Like he did in that fatal four-way. This time he's all alone with Nightmare. And Nightmare can be ever more motivated to win the title here tonight. He's been on a bit of a one-sided feud. 
because of course Warriors hasn't been on Smashdown, but finally these two collide.